Just visit the new calgaryherald.com with more of everything worth knowing. Work has already begun on the recently closed City Hall LRT station. Unlike recent platform upgrades along 7th Avenue, the final two stations will be twin platforms or gateway designs. The reason that we've organized the gateway stations across from one another is to make it easier to transfer from one line to the other. All three levels of government help fill a time capsule with C-Train memorabilia to mark the $270 million spent on transit infrastructure. The mayor hopes the C-Train will have doubled in size when the capsule is opened in 2040. Well, I hope in 2040 it's going to be doubled again in size. Uh, my aspirations, I would hope that for our city as we continue to grow, that in 30 years uh, we will have completed the southeast line of the LRT, we will have buried the, uh, the LRT in the downtown core, and we will have started on a new line 30 years from now, uh, the new north central line, uh, and maybe that will be well underway in terms of construction. Environment Minister Jim Prentice remembers working right with his community on the original sea train station design. And so it's been uh, quite something to see it develop out as the most successful urban transportation system in North America. And what we're seeing today with 7th Avenue uh, will make it that much better. The final phase of the 7th Avenue refurbishment project will see the C train lengthened to four car trains. The mayor says the new stations will not only be more efficient, but safer and more accessible. Rick Donkers, CalgaryHerald.com.